uh, a job creation uh, opportunity here in Florida. Uh, Steve Hassel uh, flew down uh, and met us in our Orlando office and uh, we started this conversation about how we can expand this operation in Florida versus another location. And uh, with that conversation, uh, we learned a little bit about street links and the great opportunity we have. And we're here today to talk about uh, the, the 50 jobs that we're going to announce today, but also filling out the space. And we expect all 500 of those, uh, the capacity to be filled and when, we, we, and, and over the years to come. I want to thank uh, uh, Rick, you and your team, uh, Hillsborough EDC, Tampa Hillsborough EDC, do a great job, great partner. We can't do these things without having a partnership here. Uh, the city, the county have all been uh, players in this project and appreciate their, their partnership. Uh, but what really makes these type of jobs happen, if you look in financial services and what's happening there in our state, uh, we are the third largest state in number of jobs in financial services. And as you know, that sector was hit pretty, pretty hard in 2008. We're seeing it come back, uh, but we're seeing companies make choices where it comes back. Do they choose in our state? Do they choose Tampa? Do they choose Hillsborough County? Or do they choose a location in the Midwest or in the Northeast? And today, they made the decision to come to Florida. We're excited about that. But why I'm really excited about that is because we're seeing this sector come back. And it's coming back strong because of leadership in the governor's office. Governor Scott, in removing job-killing uh, rules and regulations, is making and helping this sector come back. This is a sector that is driven by the ease of doing business, by making it simple getting started in an operation like here, being able to hire people, to train people, to put them to work. Uh, and that is driven from the leadership in the governor's office. So uh, we're very proud of Enterprise Florida, Rob, and his work, and as I said, the local partners. But I'm very proud of our governor, our, our I like calling him our chief economic development officer. But please join me in welcoming Governor Rick Scott. Y'all know I, I ran on a campaign to get our state back to work. So every time we can announce new jobs, it, uh, it gets closer to that 700,000 jobs that we announced that we would get done over seven years. So uh, great, thank you, and thanks. Uh, Gray's done a great job. As you know, every day Gray is traveling the state, and I guess traveling the country. And we've done uh, what, six trade missions around the world, uh, getting that business here in Florida. Uh, I'm uh, very thankful that Representative Harrison is here today. Uh, he's done a great job helping make sure this is the state. Uh, that is a great place to do business. Lower taxes, less regulation, less litigation, uh, all those things. Steve, I'm glad you're here and um, you're living here. Yes. Uh, so uh, this is a, this is a great day. And Stephen, thank you for uh, our, all your hard work on this. And Leslie, uh, thanks for all, all your hard work. I've heard uh, only great things about uh, your ability to get things done. And Rick Holmans, thank you very much for what you've done uh, at the EDC. The, uh, so today I'm pleased to announce that Street Links Lender Solutions has chosen Florida as the best place to grow and expand. They expect to add a total of 300 jobs in the next three years. And you have, I guess you have space for more than that, so hopefully that will be a, a, just a, a beginning. It will be. So, and the, uh, and we, um, as we all know, Street Links chose Florida over another state, another great state. Uh, so the choice is clear that Florida is doing the right things to get companies like Street Links uh, to expand here rather than someplace else. And again, it's little taxes, less regulation, ease of doing business. Now, Street Links is a company that has grown very rapidly over the last few years. And it's a, it's a growing, very reputable appraisal management company. In fact, they experienced exponential growth in 2011. Uh, since launching their Florida operations last year, Street Links has doubled its footprint in Tampa. As we see with today's grand opening, if, if you go look at their facility, it's a beautiful facility and there's a few open spaces there that I'm sure they'll be filling. So they currently have 190 jobs. Uh, the company is known for simplifying and improving everyday business operations for its customers. As a result, their services are used by thousands of mortgage bankers and appraisers, uh, appraisers nationwide. The expansion announced today will give Floridians new opportunities to get back to work, especially those affected during the past few years by the real estate slump. Now, the reason this is happening is because of uh, individuals like you know, everybody in this room has had an impact on what's happening in Florida. But it's because we've created an environment where companies like Street Links can do extremely well. So it's a great, it's a great honor that uh, you're here. It's a great honor for me to be here. And um, I look forward to seeing this space filled up. And hopefully you have to take more space. Uh, thank you. 